right, so we want to develop the shape functions for a beam that goes from 0 to L. Uh, we're going to do just like what we showed there on the board. We're going to have X be this. All right. A is X evaluated it. Okay, we're going to go from 0 to L, so the first one will be 0. And then the second, we're going to take the derivative of x with respect to x and evaluate that at x equals 0. And then the third one will be x evaluated at L. And then finally, the derivative of x with respect to x evaluated at L. Okay, so we have that. Then we should just be able to say n is equal to x dot inverse a. Okay, so there's the shape functions. You have four of them. One, two, three, four. And then we can plot them. Um, <clears throat> if we let L equal 1, we should be able to plot them. So there you have four shape functions. There's one, there's two. Now you notice they don't have that same partition of unity feature as before, but here you have this first shape function evaluated the first node is 1, and the second node is 0. Then the second shape function uh, evaluated the first node, uh, uh, I'm sorry, at the second node it has a slope of 1, at the first node it has a slope of 1 right here. And the third shape function 0, 1 at the, at the uh, first node, and then this, the fourth shape function has a slope of zero at the uh, second node. Okay, so I didn't write it on the board, but we can go ahead and uh, we know that I did write the bilinear form, and we know that uh, if we just pull out uh, the the term u out of the bilinear form, then whatever's left is the stiffness matrix. So I, I could go ahead and write the stiffness matrix for this as well. Uh, if I start by allocating a room for it. Then I say zero to L I take the derivative of the first respect to x, derivative j, respect to x, I'll write this, what I'm doing on the board. I just want to show it to you while I have it here. It's complaining.
Oh, I don't need to do that. Ah, it wasn't looking right, and uh, if you notice, I have to, if you notice, uh, look at the bilinear form, there, there's actually second derivatives here. So, that still doesn't look exactly correct. I'll correct this later, um, before I post it. 